Hi, everybody. Today we're going to look at the invisibility effect of the Invisible Woman in the Fantastic Four. By putting a glass jar inside a glass beaker, we're going to make the glass jar disappear by using glycerol. So because the glass flask has the same index of refraction than the glycerol, we have the impression that we can't see it. Of course, if you pay attention on the top here, you could see the top of the flask, but not the bottom, not in the middle. So here we have a small beaker with a label made out of unstable molecule for eye tracking. We're going to make this small beaker disappear by introducing it in the big beaker full of glycerol. And the only thing we can see is the label on that beaker. Maybe some of the outline, just like a little predator effect. Here's a trick you could do with the glycerol. You're taking a small beaker or any other glass object, and you're going to break that. I'm going to put these pieces inside our beaker right here. Let them swirl. I call this magic trick a youth fountain. And then you say the word, I love comicbookchemistry.com, exactly. And then you realize that <gasps> the beaker is back. This trick works only with the non-living, so don't try this with your brother. Here we go. So what happened exactly is that we had two beakers. One beaker in perfect shape was hiding inside the glycerol. And the other beaker that we broke, well, is actually still inside. Just we can't see it because it has the same index of refraction than the glycerol. You could buy glycerol uh, at the pharmacy, or you could uh, ask your chemist friend to provide you with some.